show's closer, Jason Mott, who is on the DL with a strained right elbow, won't even have his arm looked at again until the middle of the Cardinals' second homestand. With Mott out, Mitchell Boggs is expected to get the call to close. To me, this is more about Mott, who racked up 42 saves last season, than it is about Boggs, as the injury to the hard-throwing righty appears it may be much more serious than anyone first thought. As for Boggs, he doesn't rack up a ton of strikeouts, only 58 in 73 innings last year. Mitchell has four career saves and the Cardinals are expected to be a good team, so if you're looking to add a closer, Boggs is someone you have to consider. Nick Swisher will back cleanup for the Indians in Tuesday's season opener against the Blue Jays. Right-handed knuckleballer R.A. Dickey is scheduled to take the mound for Toronto. We'll see where the switch hitter hits against lefties. He's going to qualify at both outfield and first base this season. And if he turns out to be the Indians' cleanup hitter on a daily basis, look for him to challenge the 100 RBI plateau and be more valuable than many gave him credit for on draft day. In San Diego, 24-year-old rookie Jed Jerko made the Padres' opening day roster. He'll be shifting between second and third base until Chase Headley returns from a thumb injury, when he'll move to second base full-time. Jerko is no April Fool's joke. He's the Padres' best prospect, averaging over 27 home runs, 107 RBI, hitting 320 the past two years in the minors. Given he's going to end up qualifying at both second and third, you can't afford not to bid a dollar on him. And with Ryan Madsen on the DL recovering from Tommy John surgery, the Angels will turn to Ernesto Frieri to close games. The 27-year-old had 23 saves for the Angels in 2012, so he's no stranger to the position. Frieri has great metrics, so keep an eye on him closely. If he gets off to a hot start, there's a great chance that Ernesto keeps the closer's position even with Matson returns. For Roto Experts, I'm Mike Cardano.